All right, so in this video, what I'm going to show you is a quick and easy way to compile C++ on Mac. So the first thing you want to do is just open up your terminal and you just want to type in the command G++, which is the name of the compiler that we're going to be using. Now, the first time you do this, what this will do is it will ask you to install the um, developer tools. So you just want to click install and then wait for that to happen. And once you've done that, uh, what you want to do is make sure it's installed. And the place where it gets installed is if you go into your uh, home location and then main and then uh, library and then um, developer, you can see the command line tools right here has been installed. And if you go into here and then user and then bin, this uh, program right here called G++ is what we'll be using to compile our C. So once you have it installed and then you type in G++ or something like G++ dash dash version, um, we should see that it's been installed correctly and you'll see all this information right here. Again, the first time you do it, it will ask you to install the command line tools. So once you've done that, then if you press the, if you enter this command G++ dash dash version, you can see all the information about the installation. So then we just want to create a C++ file and I'm just going to do a very basic one here. So I'm just going to say new file and I'm just going to do a basic code here. But And I'm not explaining this one in this video because this video is just about um, how to compile it. So I'm just going to have a main method and then std c out hello world. So what all this method will do is print um, hello world to the screen. So then what I'm going to do is I'm just going to save this to my desktop and I'm just going to call this hello world.cpp and the extension for a C file is C++ file is .cpp like this. Then just I'm just going to hit save here. So we have our C++ file in the desktop right here. So if you want to compile the C++ file, first open the terminal and navigate to the folder where it is. So I'm just going into the desktop folder. Then you just want to do G++ and then put dash O like this and then the name of the executable file you want to compile it into. And I'm just going to call this hello world as well. And on Mac, unlike Windows, you don't need to put .exe, you can just leave it like this. This will be an executable file. And then just put the name of the um, file, the C++ source code file. So that's just hello world.cpp like this. And again, remember on a Mac, you have to do the dot slash part to use the current directory and on Windows you don't, but here you have to do dot slash and then the name of the file. And then if you press enter, what it will do is G++ will check through it for compilation errors and then compile it. So I actually have a missing semicolon right here. So I'll just put that in. So yeah, if you have any errors right here, it'll be shown right here, but then it will compile it. And what you'll see is that we have our hello world executable right here. And then I can just run this like this. And you can see that the hello world has been printed to the terminal right here. So that's how you compile a hello world pro um, or any C++ program on Mac really quickly. And again, what this does is it tells G++ to produce or output this particular executable file using this particular source file. That's exactly how the compilation works.